what's up guys welcome back to the channel so this episode is going to be on this f-150 if you guys remember we did this truck uh full detail on the channel but now we're going to hook it up with this it's going to be a red line power locks single row tailgate led bar from op 7 it's going to go right under there and we're going to bring you guys along show you how to install it step by step let's get it done So it's actually cold right now. Um, so it's freezing out here. We're in Miami, so it usually doesn't get cold. So uh, we're in the 60s right now and it's freezing for us. But uh, we're gonna start off by, uh, I believe one of the turn signals, his light is out. So uh, basically I'm gonna swap it out. But that's out of the point. We're actually gonna install it, the, the LED bar and they, they actually gave us a harness for it which is actually pretty neat i don't have to splice into it you have the option of splicing which they also give little uh taps into to tap into the into the stuff into the wiring but um when i do that we're gonna do a cleaner we have the wiring harness so first things first let's get that done to install the tail light all right so in this specific car he has uh trailer hitch trailer light situation so the bar literally plugs in right into it um i already tested it but i'm gonna test it out again basically turn the car on turn the lights on so it acts when it's at night you turn your lights on these lights turn on I don't even see them, but they're on. Um, I know his left turn signal is bad, so this one's gonna flicker. Left turn signal. So it goes a little fast because it's. See, I don't know if you see it. His left turn signal is bad, so that's why it's flickering more faster. How it normally does if if your tail light is. Uh, the turn signal is bad and right one works good it goes with the tail light and uh pretty much that works we're gonna do the backup to see if it works okay so the dro the turn signal left and right work the backup does not work um with that trailer output so i'm gonna use that white white wire and we're gonna tap into the reverse of the tail light um we're gonna use the little bits they supplied us um to be able to put this the, um, the wire and tap it into the tail light into the reverse so when it goes in the reverse it triggers that and uh i'll show you guys that now all right so you take the tail light off um this is uh the top one this is the bottom this is the middle this is the reverse what we're going to do is see that line there the yellow i mean the white and blue one the black is ground the yellow the white oh my god i'm gonna keep saying yellow the white and blue one we're gonna tap into that and that's gonna be the power that goes the moment you put reverse on the truck it's gonna send a signal to turn turn this light on the reverse light we're gonna tap into this to turn on the light bar light using this white wire so let's do that okay so basically i switched out the the signal that he had bad so now the turn signal works properly so like I said, this was the brake light, which was the middle light, which is this one right here. We took that out and we got the white with the blue cable, which is powered. The other one is black, so it's ground. And we tapped the 
white wire from the LED bar into there. Now to make sure it works before you put everything back together, we're gonna we're gonna uh, test fit it. We're gonna, we're gonna try it. We're gonna try it on. Make sure that everything works. Um, we're gonna do it with um, with it off the truck first, and then we're gonna do it at the end afterwards with the truck with everything on the truck. And uh, yeah, hopefully you can see it. Uh, actually. You know what? I'm just gonna zoom in to this one right here. This is the one that goes on the passenger side. That way you know you see the difference. Um, I'm gonna put it first. Uh, I'm gonna tr turn the truck on. When the, tr the truck turns on, the DROs turn on. I'm gonna press it a couple times the brakes and then I'm gonna put a turn signal left and right and the last one is gonna be the reverse which is going to be the white leds so give me one second let me go turn the truck on Okay, so I'm not sure how well you're able to see that, but I turned it on, DRL, brake lights, turn signal, and reverse works pro properly. Now we're just gonna end up putting everything back on the truck. I'm gonna try to see if I can find like a shaded area so I could test it out before I can get some night shots of it. And uh, yeah. So far, so good. So before we put everything back together, we're actually gonna put the bar on. Um, they supplied an adhesive promoter. So you're gonna put it on the opposite side, so on the thing, make sure you clean it, clean the alcohol. Um, and then you're gonna line it up with the center of the car. So then the bars will be like this. Take out the tape, put it on and then run the wiring so let me do that all right so the strip is on right under there uh, it's centered and then now we're gonna run the wiring under so uh you're not able to see it and that way there's no issues but yeah pretty much we're gonna run it under run behind the bumper and we should be good all right guys so we're gonna record the functions sorry for the noise there's a highway right behind us and there is wind just so you're aware um i'm gonna set you guys down on the tripod and I'm going to show you more or less how the, the steps look. Um, right now, actually, the DRLs are on. But we're going to turn that off for now. So you guys can see it in all the motions. Um, I'm going to set you guys a little bit close. Just because... Um, just so you can see everything in general. I'm going to put you guys here. Okay, so the first function is going to be, well, the DRO, how you see there. Um, so, the moment you unlock the car, it turns on. That's actually DRO. Then it's going to be the brake motion. It's going to be the left, the right, and then we're going to put it into reverse so you guys can see uh, all the functions. Give me a second.
all right guys so there it is and then when you actually lock it it goes with the tail lights so pretty pretty cool all right so later tonight we'll show you um some more videos of the lights working in the dark and uh hopefully um at that point you guys can see the difference and how bright it is so yep do the turn signals reverse and that's it all right guys that's it for today's video i want to thank you guys for watching it first of all second i want to thank op7 um for giving me the opportunity to uh try out this product and install it in one of my clients cars so shout out to op7 check them out for underglows um there's interior lights um there's a little bit of everything lighting with them including these light bars um so check them out they have good prices i actually rock a lot of stuff on a rig so check them out i use them a lot good pricing great customer service um but yeah pretty much that's it for today's video i want to thank you guys for watching like always on all the platforms and on to the next one